Hey guys, so um, this is the morning after. I woke up this morning at 6 o'clock only to find a serious allergic reaction to the proactive. I'm going to take off my glasses so you guys can see. My eyes were swollen, almost swollen shut. And then a few hours later, maybe a couple hours later, or one and a half hours later, um, the irritation on my cheek started. It's not swollen, it's just itching a lot, and it's very irritated. Um, then, uh, around 8.30, I put some cold slices of cucumber all over my cheeks and my chin and on my eyes. Woke up at 10, only to find my eyes more swollen. So I called Proactive and they said that the refining mask that I used wasn't supposed to go anywhere near my eyes or my lip area and that um, I used too much. I explained to them everything that happened. They said I used too much. And also the advanced blemish treatment. I used too much of it on my cheeks, which is why my cheeks are irritated right now. But my forehead is fine, thank God, because honestly, I really deal with my whole face being irritated. Um, having my eyes swollen like this is big enough. Um, so I'm about to show you guys my eyes. The swelling has gone down. They told me that I should get cold washcloth place it over my eyes and they're giving me my money back and they're going to send me the more gentle formula and so yeah it's itching a lot under my eyes and over my eyes it's swollen um this one has it the worst i guess i use most on it there yeah it looks really really bad and like honestly this is after it the swelling went down some see so these are reasons why I'm always grateful that I wear glasses and I have to go out today I would have taken some Benadryl but I have to go out today and so I'm going to just put on some shades and go out I'm gonna have someone accompany me that way I don't like walk into people or whatever but yeah, this is the morning after, after I used Proactive. Um, not to say that if you use Proactive, it will react like this. It's just the way that I used it, I shouldn't have used it. And also I have very, very highly sensitive skin. So I probably should have went with the gentle formula in the first place. Rather than taking their word for um, the formula being more gentle than the first formula that I first developed the allergy to so once I get the gentle formula I'm not gonna apply it to my face they suggested that I apply it to my neck and behind my ears and if I develop a reaction to it from there I would know not to use it and they're sending that to me for free and it's just gonna be a two-week trial honestly I'm tired of looking at my eyes in this um, computer and I'm sure I'm freaking you guys out um, but yeah this is the morning after. This is my reaction to the proactive. This is just proof to show you guys how hard it is to have acne and have very sensitive skin. It's not that I don't try different things. It, this is why I try not to try certain things. And this is why I prefer most of the time to use natural stuff. Even if they take longer, I'd rather use them instead of using all these products with so many chemicals. I'm only going to try the formula really because I want to give them the benefit of the doubt. But um, they said that I can continue to use the body wash because it has the active ingredient in the body wash, is salicylic acid. And so um, <clears throat> I'm not allergic to salicylic acid. Um, I know that for sure because I did have a Burt's Bees spot treatment that contained mainly salicylic acid and nothing happened. Um, but maybe I am allergic to the benzoyl peroxide um, in the formula. Um, 
but the gentle formula they're sending me, the active ingredient in it is not benzoyl peroxide, it's salicylic acid. So I'm going to give that a shot. But um, I do need to be very careful with the acne spot treatment that they have, the advanced blemish treatment, because it contains, and I should have read this, especially as a chemist, I should have read this, the active ingredient um, for it was benzoyl peroxide, and it was 6% versus the 2.5 percent that's in the um that's in the the wash and also in the moisturizer there's only 2.5 percent versus the six percent in advance that's probably why it's called advance but um that really was too harsh on my skin so if i do use that again i will definitely mix it with something else and not put as much at all i put a good amount I was I guess I was just really excited um, and willing to try something new with an open mind I'm gonna go now because this is really embarrassing and it's bugging so see you guys keep me in prayers <laughs> that my eyes stop swelling up and actually goes down especially before the weekend Alright guys, I'll keep you posted. God bless.